What's up everyone, it's Agent Juicy here today and I'm back here with another video for you guys on how to get BlackBerry Beta Zone uh, and BlackBerry Channel basically or any new release of BlackBerry software before it's actually released. So basically you're going to get the developer version I guess or the preview version if you want to call it. So let's dive right into it. So this is the third time I'm doing this video and it really really drains you out so let's get started so uh, the BlackBerry link you have to get this this is a new software uh, make sure and download it all you have to do is put in it put in BlackBerry link in Google click on the first one that you see and it's gonna look exactly like this you're gonna have the option to download on your PC or download on your Mac and you just click on whichever one it is it's around 144 megabytes so yeah might take a little while to download and install it took me about 20 minutes with this uh, old computer uh, that being said just click on whichever one download it and let's move on so after you download that just leave it there you don't have to do anything the next thing what we're gonna look at it's the black you're gonna Google is a BlackBerry beta zone I will provide links for most of it uh, I think I provide links for everything except uh, to my actual email account. So what all we have to do is basically uh, go to the BlackBerry Beta Zone. It's going to look like this. You're going to click on the first one, and that is going to look exactly like this. All you have to do, it's really simple. If you don't have a BlackBerry ID, and if you're wondering what the hell's a BlackBerry ID, uh, maybe I'm not sure. <laughs> you should stop here and don't continue. Uh, a BlackBerry ID looks like this, basically your email password, and just ask you log in. You need it for your Apple, you need it to log in to your actual device. So when you click sign in now, I believe it's going to look exactly like... Oops. Well, when you sign in, it's going to ask you this very this precise thing. Are you existing Betazone user? If you aren't... Well, it's your lucky day. You get one more account from BlackBerry. So just click on New Beta Zone User, and you just click right here. When you click on that, it's going to teleport you to a page that looks like this right here. So I filled out this a little earlier before, so it would work a lot faster. However, if you live in... The Middle East, sometimes due to their government uh, privacy or privacy purposes, they don't allow certain sites, and I think this might be one of them. But however, there's ways to get around it. It's called uh, creating a, a new network, but yeah, that's a whole nother thing. If that does happen to you, just comment me in the section down below and I'll tell you what to do. So fill out this make sure wherever you see the red asterisk it's required so make sure and fill it out you don't have to put your actual details and scroll down here put your device so for this I'm gonna do it two different ways so hopefully it works out the first way is going to be for the Q10 so next make sure like I said select everything don't leave any fields empty you're gonna to come to this page right here BlackBerry beta zone registration uh, this is where you sign over your soul to BlackBerry I'm just kidding uh, you're gonna hit agree submit and they're gonna ask you for your soul again I kid so in the BlackBerry when you sign up for it what's gonna happen for your when you sign up for the beta zone account you're gonna get this I was supposed to tell you and all you have to do is just confirm your email. It sends you to the web page and stuff like that. You just fill that out. You just enter your password and you're set to go. So then you're going to end up here, like I said. Um, so basically, the only thing that you're going to be eligible for right now is the BlackBerry OS slash BlackBerry 10. You're going to look for this. Don't even look here because this is basically your programs, but just look right here. Focus on this. So you're going to click on this one right here. And you're going to wait for it to load. You're going to see, do you want to participate? You're going to click yes. You're going to click submit. Then you're going to say, hi, Agent Juice. I'm just kidding. You're going to sign over your soul again to BlackBerry. I did this four times, so to me it's a bit 
tough now, so just hit submit. Come on. My internet's a bit slow today. Yellow. So, um, this is what it's going to look like. You're going to come to this page. It's going to tell you thank you. Blah. You're going to look for this right here. Download BBM channels for client to BBOS 10. You're going to click right here. If you don't see this, you're going to click downloads. So, um, just for the fun of it, let's see how it looks in downloads. So, this is how it looks in downloads. And let's go back. Just, just for... There's always going to have one person who's going to be like, oh, I don't see it, I hate your video! And give it a thumbs down. I'm just, I kid. But anyway, you're going to come back to the same exact thing, so just click Agree. Now, if you're on BlackBerry OS 10, I'm going to show you how to do that. If you're on OS 5, uh, wait right here. It's going to have an exact video like this uh, for you guys, and I think I should have a link right about now. So I'm going to stop the video here. Well, it's your lucky day. I guess you're on BlackBerry 10, so... Let's just see how this goes. So BlackBerry channel right here. You're going to select 10 slash 10.1. Uh, basically, this is for the Q10 or Z10. It doesn't matter. Um, so basically, what are you going to do is you're going to stop for a second. You're going to read this. Connect your device to the PC. Download now. Enter your device PIN. Uh, click download. A key will email to your BlackBerry ID. Uh, and basically you're going to run the channel loader. So, like I said, if you did not download the BlackBerry Link software, you're going to have to stop what you're doing and go do it now. Because uh, if you don't do that, it won't show up. So, what I'm going to do, it's, it's very simple. I'm just going to hit download now. And uh, it's asking me for my device pin, so I'm just going to quickly enter it. Do not add this pin, please. I beg of you. Kind sir. May you do not add my pin. So, let's hit download now. So, what's going to happen, it's a magician is going to pop out of the screen, and it's going to appear. I'm just kidding. So, it's going to have 23 uh, megabytes to download, so I'm going to be back when it uh, finishes downloading. So, when it's finished uh, downloading, installing, whatever you want to call it, just click on it right here. You're going to ask you to run this file. Like I said, make sure you have the BlackBerry Link software if you're running OS X. Make sure you have that downloaded. Um, so, just hit run. You're going to see it's loading application to your phone. It's going to connect. And it's going to say connect to your BlackBerry 10 device. My device is actually connected. However, I have a password on it. So, it will not install because I don't want to lose my uh, channel pin if you want to call it, and let's go back for one second. So, in the email, over the break, when you hit the download now button, it's going to send you an email. You may take a little while, but I got, like you can see right here, I got two, uh, because like I said, I did this three times before, and yeah, just let's, let's not even go into it, guys. So what's going to happen, It's uh, you're going to retry this, it's going to load the application, you make sure your device is connected, it's going to ask me for the PIN. What's the key code you might, oh. So what's the key code you might ask, because it asks us for a key code that was sent to your email. So what you're going to do is go to your email, you're going to see the key code is as follows. Follows, so you're going to hit follows. I kid. So I think this is it. So what you're going to right click, copy, you're going to go back, you're going to paste it. Make sure there's absolutely no spaces here or at the end or uh, any stuff like that. So you're going to hit OK. What you're going to see, it's going to ask you for the device password again. And basically you put in the password if you have one. If it doesn't ask you for a password, just continue as normal. So all you have to do is finish uh, the install. One thing I must let you guys know, I'm going to leave it right here, and the reason that I'm doing that is because I do not want to lose my channel uh, pin. I had the 107th, I believe, uh, pin that when, when they launched it, so I don't want to lose that. So all you have to do, put in your password, hit next, 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 next. Your phone, it's going to basically go black for a microsecond. 
uh, it's going to close down the BBM application if you have it open. What's going to happen, it's, you're going to see uh, the BlackBerry channel get a new uh, update, sort of. And you're just going to browse around. If you don't find a channel button, just go back to my video where I explain what BlackBerry channel is and stuff like that, and you'll see how you find the actual channel. You're going to get a channel pin. I'm going to put my channel so you guys can follow me and thank me and like this video. So like I said, I'm not going to continue it because I don't want to lose that pin. I hope you guys do understand that. Um, so this is Agent Juicy. I guess for OS 10 people, I'm out. Um, hit the like button. Uh, share it, I guess. No, I actually don't even worry to share it. Just hit the like button. I, that's all I really care about. Um, Agent Juicy, I'm out.